Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lennon. Hi guys, doing it. Welcome back to part four of our Parabellum campaign playing as Parthia. So let's get into it and let's get back up to speed on where we left things up last time. So we are going to work from east to west and in the east we have this settlement which is doing um, actually not that bad. Um, we can do some of this. Um, but we might look at that later because I think I have more pressing matters to spend my cash. Um, over here we have an army which I don't know really what to do with just yet. Maybe march it east slowly once um, this is all settled. Um, over here, this is a little bit of shit settlement. Uh, we have a rebellion going, so let's get rid of that quickly. And we are losing that. Okay, that is not great. Those are slingers or axes? Those are hillmen. Like I said, we have more pressing ways to uh, spend our cash. So I could use another archer over here. And now we would win this. But I feel like I am going to fight this. So we'll come back to this in a second because that would be funny fighting that with the first one of the first time we see our elephants at work. Um, over here we have an army that just slapped a rebellion in this area. And then over here you slapped a rebellion at this place, that is fine. Over here we are recruiting to see if we can deal with this rebellion force. And that is all we can do over there. Um, that is doing well. You are actually pretty stable. And over here we did put our army into a little bit of a tricky situation. We kicked out the we killed the Armenian army last episode. Um, that was right before Pontus declared war on us. And there is a gigantic army that will probably nick us in the end turn. Um, so that's everything going on here, and I want to go for these territories, but I feel like he's going to be beat me to it. Um, so first things first, let's do this. Let's see what we can do here. Um, we have skirmisher advantage, we have the calf advantage. So I would say put up the spears. And then rear charge with the elephants and the cavalry. And I still I am getting some reinforcements, so that is good. Um, let's get you guys over that way. And let's Wait a second for our reinforcements. Our reinforcements have arrived. So now we have basically every advantage. And you go into group one. Something like that. And these guys are very light support infantry. Uh, we'll get you guys like that, like that. Like this, and like that. Okay, so once everyone is here. Super heavy mounted missile. Nice. So we have like two, four, five. Yeah, we have 20 elephants, two persons per elephant. Nice. Yes. Oh, these guys are already winded. <laughs> Don't 
Where are you guys at? I don't see you. Oh, there you are. Oh, he has a big line. See, what we could do is just start the missile engagement. And then see if they want to come to us. Yeah, I think this is good because I can put these two on this flank, these two on that flank, support wherever is needed. And that should be nearly in range. You cut a frax. Already go that way. Do we at least kill one? No. Da 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 dum 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 dum. These guys are good. <laughs> that's like forty. Holy crap, that's nearly a hundred dead on the charge. Take that one. Oh wow, that killed half. That killed a whole unit on the charge. Dum 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 dum. Uh, okay, elephants. March through here, please. Just keep on marching, keep on marching. <laughs> keep on wrecking everything along the lines. Probably could have done it without half the infantry, just, just the elephants would have done the trick. Frightened by horses? Quick fun fight with our elephants. Uh, archers. We should probably stop firing. Winning decisively. Yeah, no shit. That should be it, right? Oh, how much? How many kills? Seven hundred and thirty-six. <gasps> Holy crap! Two sixty-nine as well. Nice. Archers both above the hundreds. We did very well for this. That is really good. Um. Yeah, see, those Axemen are, can be pretty dangerous, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, I will take this time to say to you, directly to your face, 
If you do enjoy this episode, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment if you have any tips or tricks, and by all means, do subscribe to the channel as it would be greatly appreciated. And we are over here, we are donezo. Um, and let's end it real fast. Um, and you were mercenary. You were mercenaries. You were mercenary. One sixty-three. Eight hundred. Is it actually worth it to keep the elephants? I honestly, I don't think so. Um, I think that's all we're gonna do for this turn. Let's see, we can always. Oh, we can recruit better elephants. Cataphract elephants. I want those. 2600. If these guys don't attack us, we'll we'll get the uh, we'll get the elephants. This is going to be the elephant episode. Um, honestly, I will save all of my all of my money just to do that. Uh, although I do need to spend some money. Oh, what do we have here? The events. Um, two food minus penetry rate for spies. E, let's go for that then. So, uh, edict. Oh, sorry, sorry, forgot about this one. that and let's start with replenishment and I don't really need the edicts right now I think would like to put out some more war targets because like Aracosia has like three full stacks just doing absolutely nothing over here yeah Pontus yeah I, w I thought that was gonna happen Ooh. Honestly? Honestly, do we fight it? We have four slingers. We have the horse archers. They have the infantry. They have a lot of infantry. Honestly, I think I'm gonna unresolve this one. Nice. That probably means... Uh, let's go for political favor. Politics is fine. Uh, what was that about Ekbatana? Rebellion. Well, you are on your way. Um. Oh, that army didn't do shit. Okay. We can march into here soon. I would need maybe a turn of replenishment. Um, you're doing absolutely fantastic. Are we winning this? 
Oh, those are Roman units. Well, fuck it. I, I'm, I'm, I'm dubbing this the elephant. That's basically all my money. Um, do I want infantry to fight as long alongside this? Roman levies. Those guys could be the death of me. Uh, I would need a little bit of infantry. Fuck it. <laughs> this episode is just about having fun with elephants. Not being too, not gonna be too seriously. Not doing too too much serious shit. So have a little bit of fun with my elephant cataphracts. And honestly, I don't know why I'm concerned. Oof. Oof. Those guys look awfully menacing. Uh, let's get those guys in there and let's get you. Probably, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna wait for my reinforcements. I'm just gonna march these elephants into, into this place. See, if all fails, I'll have these. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll have these guys as the reinforcing. Uh, well, shit, now everything. Is out of line. Where is everybody? Are you guys in the trees? Why are you all the way over there? You guys start firing and once they start moving we'll move back hopefully they'll chase like these are spears so elephants are not the best units to kill them but Honestly, if I can get two or two flanks into this position. Oh, they really have to get close. He's chasing, that's good. Ooh, whistlings are a little bit in trouble. Uh, let's get you close by for reinforcements. Ooh, this is gonna be exciting! First trample charge, just straight in. Oh, that's gonna suck for these guys. The battle is turning in our favor. <laughs> we haven't done anything. Oh, they're already. Ooh, wow. We haven't even done anything. Oh, 
first this one and then you do that Okay, 320. Unbraced. <laughs> oh, they're less than a hundred. And over here, without the trample charge. Oh, they did run a mock in the back of the, yeah, that unit. Oof. Oof. <laughs> Some guys are absolutely shredded. Oh, I'm having so much fun with this. So this is a heavy unit. I'm curious to see how they are how they are holding up. If they are actually able to kill some elephants. Okay, that's probably friendly fire. <laughs> there is nothing left. 492, 434. Two kills, 25 kills. That shit is fucking funny, man. If we actually could support like two elephant units per army, that would be insane. Although, although this cost me 5,000 uh, just to recruit them, and I believe it's 12, it's nearly 2,500 in upkeep for both of them. So that is insanely expensive. Sorry to see. You. I'm I'm really sorry to see you go, but there's no other way. With one turn of replenishment, I'm going this way. So maybe two maybe two turns. Uh, you can deal with that next up next turn. You stay there a little bit longer. You stay there a little bit longer. Okay, so our stuff is looking better. Like everything seems to be a little bit better under control. I see a lot more green numbers, which is some stuff I like. Uh, we'll do that next turn. For gold, uh, only ask that we can have trade between us. No, I don't think so. Because you are right in the line of expansion. Oh, there's another Pontic army. Nice. 
Uh, a great omen. Is there something we could do there? No. Unhappy, unhappy. We can deal with unhappy populace. Do we have enough food? Although we could use a little bit extra. So if we get plus 15 for having an army there, you're minus 60, but that's okay, because we'll deal with this. There's no elephants in this army, so I'm just going to auto reserve it. And now you're plus 7. And that's also plus 2 public, or public order. Nice. That is going great over there. You are actually green. Wow. And that really helps um, with taxes. Tax rate will help in increase that as well. Like, happy cities will definitely give more taxes. It's like you. Minus 25% wealth from all sources and minus 15 tax rate plus 20% corruption. God damn. That is killing me. And these are indifferent, so that is fine. And then if we look at, like, next turn... Um, armor, melee defense, press the fun culture, public order. Let's go with that first. Ooh, tech wise, upkeep for armies. That is fine because we have quite a lot of them. And let's see. I feel like we're making decent progression in the right direction. Like taking out, trying to take out Pontus. Oh, that was not Pontic army. Okay, there. Why? That's fucking bullshit. Um, okay, since you are not taking that territory, I will. Motiv See, motivated people. That's doing what? Plus 10% tax, 10% wealth. No corruption anymore. Nice. Even have encouraged people. Um, Susia. So yeah. Oh, that's still. This army is still there. Okay, yeah. Um, let's get to starting moving that way. Outrage, uh, that is fine. Markman is destroyed, Quadi is destroyed. Yeah, but you are still going up. You will do your best over there. Sinop, Trapezos. That's an easy clap. I believe Pontus is Hellenic, so that... Oh no, it's actually good. 
Nice. Um, yeah, if you would be so kind. Celtic use, Celtic skirmishers, Celtic fresh spears. Okay, if you would be so kind to take out this army and take this settlement, then I can come in there next turn. I think that's a very good deal. Plus four cultural conversion, nice. Second wind group. That's a good one as well. Oh, did I just waste a turn on that? Ooh, plus, oh, I already have that one, okay. I already have this one as well. That is kind of annoying, like you can't really tell. Yeah, okay, there's no turns above it. We're doing, we're, I feel like we're doing pretty good, actually. And now you will not be able to take this, hopefully, so I, then I can take it. Um, we can, however, put a target on your head. Oh, no, 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 no. Do that. How are you happy with me? Because um, I don't, I honestly, I don't want that settlement. Ooh. He has javelins, I have infantry. Honestly, I don't want to fight this. I'm okay, I'm okay with winning. Probably wouldn't have done it any better, so. Usually I would do it the other way around, but like this was the, the funny episode. So usually I would auto resolve the elephants and fought like this battle. But to be honest, <laughs> I'm not feeling that today. You also have a plague. For you, my lord. Oh, that's not a very big army. Okay. Uh, eh, it's gonna be kind of tough if this guy starts to attack, but. Latin rebels, that is fine. You should probably go over there, start recruiting some spears. So next up, uh, next turn you can get over there. There was another rebellion, right? Is that the only rebellion? Kidri and Gehera, I don't mind that. How we're doing everywhere else we're doing fine you are happy so happy I could move out yes as another army joining the war effort um, let's go with extra food um, let's see I feel like we're I feel like I'm missing something. 
But whatever I'm missing, that will be for next episode. Because ladies, ladies and gentlemen, that's where we're going to leave things off for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this funny elephant episode. Uh, if you did, be sure to leave a like on it. Leave a comment if you have any tips or tricks or questions that you want to have answered. And by all means, don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well. Would be greatly appreciated. So thank you guys again. And I'll see you guys next time. Ciao. Peace.